Hey, what's up, y'all? Y'all know my slogan. I don't know it all, but I know what I've been through. Now, before we get into this video, please make sure you head on down to Instagram and follow us on our official Instagram page at hookahanonymous underscore. All right, maybe to be a little more explicit, a little more censored, and share content freely without running the risk of having our channel terminated. So, once again, make sure you head on down to Instagram and follow us on our official Instagram page at hookahanonymous underscore. All right, now let's get into what you guys came here to see. Now, the internet has been buzzing social media all over about who the alleged killer, and I'm gonna say alleged, you know, who the alleged killer of your boy Takeoff actually is. Um, it's all type of skeptics, it's all type of fingers being pointed at this one and that one. I don't really want to say too much names or say too much, period, because at the end of the day, it's very confusing. You know, and we all know, like, when it comes to Takeoff Death, we all know that it's a lot of sketching is going, it's a lot of foolishness. I always tell y'all, when it's confusing, nine times out of ten, it's because there's a lie involved. Nine times out of ten, somebody trying to cover something up. And I feel personally that's what it is with this situation. Because we've seen too much loophole, I mean, not loopholes, we've seen too many holes in, in the story, and we've seen too much foolishness going on before we, it wasn't even a week, <laughs> and you got a whole bunch of stories coming out. So at the end of the day, I feel in due time, the real is going to come out, the truth always does, we just got to stay on the lookout. But for now, what we're going to talk about is your boy Lil' Cam. Now, allegedly, and we're going to keep going with the legend. Allegedly, he's a guy who had on a yellow sweater who people are alleging that he was the one that held Takeoff at gunpoint for actually firing the fatal shot that actually killed um, Takeoff, right? Now, it came out that he did it, and then shortly after it came out that he was the one that actually did it, they're saying that he was actually killed in Houston, Texas, you know, overnight. Now, I thought when I first heard that, I'm like, all right, you know, it sounds kind of sketchy. And the reason why I said that is because it seemed like once it blew up that he was the one that did X, Y, and Z, all of a sudden, he's been shot and killed himself. You know, um, not only that, it's coming out that he actually wasn't deceased. People are saying he's dead and he's over there on Twitter tweeting back and forth. So what I want, like I said, I never was the one that said he was the one that did it. But what I want to clear up is this. Um, he actually isn't deceased. If this is the one that y'all talking about did X, Y, and Z, he's actually still alive. You know, he's tweeting. Um, I posted the tweets in the video so y'all can check it out yourselves. But he's tweeting back and forth. People are saying, yo, why are they saying that you're dead? And he's somebody even went as far as saying that he got an obituary up. <laughs> and if that's in fact true, that's crazy because that just shows people are going to the greatest of limbs to prove a lie. You know, however, if you're the one, if you're one of the ones that's saying that Lil' Cam was in fact the shooter and he was killed, I'm just coming to debunk that rumor right now. And um, his his um, his Twitter is actually Little Cam Fifth Ward or something like that. Let me see. Um, his Twitter is for y'all to go check out yourself. His Twitter is at Lil' Cam Fifth. So at Lil' Cam. The number five, TH. So y'all go check them out for yourself. Now, before we get out of here, make sure you like this video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hit that bell so you're notified every time we drop new content. And remember, as long as you keep on watching, I'm going to keep on dropping. And I'm out.